Budweiser tour in Jacksonville. About to take a tour. Drink me a little beer. <laughs> they got their fan running on something. So fuck that doing something. When I see you got a Someone's flipping it up and then it it attaching to that. Damn, people out of jobs right now because of machines. Clean jeans looking like spandex, and I don't wanna play no games with you. So stop playing. I don't wanna play. Everyone, I just got Sophie. So happy to have her. She's a warm-hearted person who loves me till the end. Uh, she is a Labrador and Australian Shepherd. fucking dollars beats how the fuck did she even get up there to get him ladies and gentlemen this is the main event of the evening. We recently posted a thread on Reddit and Facebook looking for some help to roast Derek Ross. Unfortunately, we didn't get very much attention. So while I was on my last trip in LA, I put in a phone call to a special friend. Hello? Chris, what's up? It's Hoskins from Average Joe Tube. Oh shit. What up, boy? Are you still dating that fine ass white girl you had at the comedy store? Or did she sub up yet? So we're up. I didn't call to get my balls busted, bro. I called because we're trying to do a roast on D. Ross. D. Ross? The arena football player? Shit. <laughs> That's easy, man. Last time I saw him, I was talking about the Green Mile, and he thought it was a porno with the Incredible Hulk. That boy is crazy. <laughs> Girls come up to me at the club and tell me he cries during sex. Mostly because of the pepper spray. Did you see they selling his jersey on Amazon.com? It said, people that bought this item also purchased a stool and a rope. Women love Derek. Love, love, love Ross Boy. Right up until they figure out the difference between an A and the letter N. They want that NFL money, not that AFL money. <laughs> hey, check this out. They got him listed at 250 pounds. Where the hell do they weigh his ass at? The motherfucking moon? When Facebook has double dang a day for his team picture, it comes back as the Kool-Aid man. His profile pic comes back as unlocked player. That boy is so big and black, he can't swim in the ocean because I think he's an oil spill. D. Ross, man. The man of many nicknames. The boss, the crackpot, the goat, Black Jabba. <laughs> if they made a movie on his life, I'm not sure 
sure what they'd call it, but it wouldn't be Lord of the Rings. Can a brother get a ring? Just a ring? One ring? All he wants is a ring. <laughs> and tell him to change that touchdown dance, man. It's so old now. I didn't know if he was doing a touchdown celebration or auditioning for a day job. <laughs> I love Ross, though. He's a pioneer. Just another brother whose achievements were stolen by the white man. Yeah, that's right, I said it. Long before there was Elvis and blue suede shoes, there was Chuck Berry and Johnny B. Good. Long before there was Eminem and Slim Shady, there was Tupac Shakur and California Love. And long before there was Bruce Jenner and Caitlyn Jenner, there was Derek Ross and Precious. See you at Target! But seriously though, Derek, you're my boy, man. I love what you've done with the league. You're the greatest of all time, and I wish you the best. Hey, Chris, I appreciate it, man. All right, man, take care. I'm out.